As we switch our focus here, the USF College of Nursing is taking a direct approach to tackling a nursing shortage with an all-out effort to expand nursing education. ABC Action News reporter Mary O'Connell heard from school leaders and students on why they think these efforts will help. Piper Vaughn's passion for helping others led her to become a student at USF's College of Nursing. The nurse shortage, something she's seen firsthand. As a student who gets to go in and see it in clinicals, I mean, you are living it every day. I go in and my nurses have about like six patients that they have to take care of. Now the school is working to tackle the issue. USF Health tells me the governor approved $33 million in the budget for the USF Health College of Nursing to expand its infrastructure and current footprint on USF's Tampa campus. And the primary component of this renovation is to really transform nursing pedagogy to allow us to introduce a lot more simulation activities, uh, a lot more simulation using a true simulated hospital environment, uh, using artificial intelligence, virtual reality. USF Health also says the governor approved $6.9 million in recurring funding for the college to hire faculty and staff. By 2028, the USF Health College of Nursing will graduate over 750 undergraduate nurses each year, a roughly 200% increase over the five-year period. All efforts to help solve a nurse shortage crisis. It's not something new that came on because of the COVID-19 pandemic. What we experienced was a severe exacerbation of the problem because of the pandemic. I think it made me want to become a nurse even more because I want to help fix it. And for those on the fence, this student says just go for it. I think it's just so awesome. There's so many different opportunities. In Tampa, Mary O'Connell, ABC Action News.